Dr. Sean McDonald, 101. Woo! Woo! <laughs> <laughs>
for a lot of different people um, is basically like an organi organizing structure. It's what we, we, you know, what, what Tyson does is community organizing, so you can see this is what we do. And that's what Tyson can continue to do in this process is be a container for contact information, for communication, for doing some of the organizing around this. And um, hopefully promote consistent messaging um, around being united against violence in our community. Uh, and with that, um, I would like to invite other voices um, into the space now to discuss um, what their experiences have been thus far in working to support CC and what brings them to this work today. Go ahead, Abby. <laughs> You don't have to, you don't have to. Okay. I'm Abby Beasley. I'm a case manager at Safe Zone. Um, I've known CC ever since I started working there in 2008, <coughs> 2008, and I was a case manager for three years until, well, technically for three years until she aged out, but I've been in touch with her ever since. Can people hear? Yes. I hear a little bit. I was a case manager for three years. She aged out. I've been in touch with her ever since. Um, obviously, uh, we all know why. I'm looking at you, baby. Oh. <laughs> How about everyone? I'm Jermaine. I'm CC's brother. Um, I'm here because um, this is a wrong. It, but the whole situation is just wrong how it all happened. And I really believe that my sister should not be in there. She's a really cool person, really nice, outgoing person. And I support her 100%. Um, I appreciate everybody coming out today and yesterday for the court hearing. We just hope that you guys can come out on July 11th to, to support her. We just asked for a fair trial, even though we know it's not going to be fair. She's transgender and she's of color. So it's not going to be fair. So we're just looking for the most support that we can to help so that the justice can see that what's right is right and what's wrong is wrong and they need to, they need to get it together really. Hi everyone, I'm Kim Coleman. And um, the first time I ever see CC was when I saw the post. So I do not know CC. I uh, thoroughly wholeheartedly want to show support and I know that people do not know her even really want to show her and that we want to hear this from her. Are there any other people that would like to speak to the work that they've been doing? Or what brings them here? Um, so to give kind of an update of what's happened in the past day, uh, we had the, um, her first hearing uh, was scheduled to be yesterday, um, and we did tack the courtroom yesterday, as many as you, you know that we're there. Um, they, um, what do you call it, postponed? Continue the hearing. Um, really, I do this kind of work all the time. Uh, I totally know what I'm doing. That's why I'm at the front of the room. Um, um, uh, they continued the hearing until July 11th, like uh, Jermaine explained. Um, we had a press conference and rally outside. We expected maybe the Star Tribune to show up. Um, just about every media contact that I could think of showed up. Um, uh, uh, like I said, I've never done this before. Um, a lot of the people that were there have never done that before. Um, we didn't have much of a media strategy. <laughs> um, so we all kind of just got on camera and said a lot of what we felt. Um, some of that was put out into the world, some of it wasn't. Um, uh, there's a lot of varying degrees of media that's out there right now um, in terms of television, blogging, Facebook, uh, you know, newspapers, it's all, radio. It's all being talked about. Um, if you go on some of the blog feeds, uh, we're not we're not really winning the fight, um, and so uh, we need to kind of think about some of the media strategy. Uh, we have developed a new press release about the rally that happened yesterday, um, and hopefully our uh, a, a small working group of folks working on media can review that press release and start coming up with some of that media strategy. Um, I met with the Legal Rights Center this morning, um, and uh, they're the folks who tip on her case. Um, and discuss some of what's going on with her case and, and what they're going to be, um, uh, what their strategy is going to be and how that relates to how our media strategy should look. 
uh, for more more or less of better words that make any sense. <laughs> um, and hopefully the working group that uh, uh, is is doing legal support can can talk more about that. Um, those are all, all the big updates that I can think of that have happened in the past day or two. If there's things that are missing that people feel like should get covered, please shout them out right now.